All right, fine. Sutton, get in here. Yes, sir? Mike's group at the DWR canceled our plans for modifications to Chase River. Mm. Find out who his boss's boss is. Okay. Here's his number, sir. Thank you very much. Okay. Hi, this is Andy Watson with Watson Enterprises. I would like to meet with Brian as soon as possible. Okay, thank you. Now, Brian, we both know how important a new riverfront area would be to this area. My engineers are very concerned about the environment. They are experts at protecting the environment and have assured me that the modifications needed would pose no harm to the river whatsoever. In fact, they told me that they could improve this situation for the fish and reduce flooding downstream. Would you look into what Mike's concerns are and see if they make sense to you? Thanks, Mike, for taking time out of your day to meet with me. Andy Watson stopped by my office the other day. He really hit it big with the oil investment down south and wants to spend a lot of money making it a better place. His political family has done well in the area and in many of the offices. Andy is skilled at running over people and getting his way somehow. Anyway, what do you think we should do about this Chase River project? Um, can't work. The current area is critical for major surge of flood waters and the biology division graded the river section as a major natural resource. Andy said his engineers have created a special solution that can even improve the flood protection in the environment. I think this is overstating the engineering solution presented. Well, what should I tell Andy when I call him back? Well, tell him the Chase River project as it was presented is not acceptable. He's welcome to have his engineer create different solution and we would be glad to review those. We are not going to do engineering work for them. We just review and comment on what is presented. All right, sounds good, thank you. Mm -hmm. You're welcome. Hello, I met with Brian today. Okay, well I'm out of town right now, but how'd it go? Uh, he told me how Andy is pressuring him to look into the Chase River project. He was respectful of our opinion and I hope he communicates accurately to Andy that the current design is not acceptable. Okay, well, I guess we'll see. By the way, the new designs on Chase River Project are needed. It increases the Chase River flood elevation by two feet, which is far greater than a tenth of the foot allowance. Other developments in the area will be flooded much more frequently, and many of the properties will be damaged because of this. There will also be sediment from the construction that will be destructive to the ecosystem. You're welcome to have your engineers create different solutions, and we'd be glad to review them. Now, Brian, we've been through this a thousand times. We both know my engineers have done a great job. I don't want to have, I don't have any more patience with this. Put pressure on Mike to approve the plans or I'm going to start calling Mayor Stan. He'll start piling heat on you until you boil. Stan tac Stan's tactics are brutal. You wouldn't do that. I'd do it in an instant. I can't do that. The current design causes flooding in the area development. I know your reasoning, but we can't fight with Andy and his political influences. We both will be tortured and eventually reassigned or even terminated. It would be much easier if we just give up now. Surely the design is okay. So let me get this straight. You want me to just sign off on the current plans knowing what we know? I think you have to. 